is involved in that, and what, what I would also call cognitive endurance, that need for kids to be able to look at this, and then look at this, and then look at this, and stick to it all the way down the page. The community was invited down to the Hopkinton Middle School Library for a question and answer session with the finalist for the Assistant Superintendent of Curriculum position, Dr. Carol Cavanaugh. Superintendent of Schools, Dr. Kathy McLeod, explained the process of narrowing down the candidates for the position. So we posted the position and we had 53 applicants. For, of the 53 applicants, we screened 18 of them um, and during the paper screening process. And then we reduced that to six finalists that we brought in for the first tier of interviews. Um, that was interview committee made up of administrators and um, teachers and parents. Um, next, the that committee recommended three finalists to the second tier and that was basically central office, the directors that met with Dr. Cavanaugh. Uh, the next step in our process was to go out to Uxbridge and to meet with at 12 or 15 administrators that she's been working with in different interviews during that process. We were there for the morning and we were able to have candid conversations with people that she's currently working with in Uxbridge. And so tonight is our final step in the process. Um, she met with the school committee um, before this meeting and then the public forum. And finally, um, the school committee will speak with me, give me their feedback on their thoughts, and I will be making a recommendation to the school committee um, on on the 25th, so their next school committee meeting, so February 25th, um, following my, my opportunity to have a conversation with them. I haven't had a chance to t speak with them um, tonight, but um, Dr. Kavanaugh is, we are very, very enthusiastic about moving her forward, um, and she is the finalist that we're recommending at this point. Uh, we'll wait, as I said, to speak with the school committee on their thoughts, having just interviewed her tonight. So I'm Carol Kavanaugh. Um, I have spent the last 25 years in public education. I started in the Auburn Public Schools and in the Auburn Public Schools I was an English and Latin teacher. I became an English department chair there and then after uh, 13 years in that district I moved on to the Westboro Public Schools. And again I was an English teacher, an English department chair and a Latin teacher and then I moved into administration after five years in Westboro. So for five years I was the assistant principal of Westboro High School and in that role I was very largely the person who did all of the curriculum work there. In addition to working at Westboro High School, I was also running an educational consulting business and uh, so that kind of s sort of fueled my need to do curriculum work because I was working with people pre-K to 12 in a variety of districts in central Massachusetts. I teach for Lesley University and Worcester State University and so I was working with teachers in that capacity as well and in 2008 I went back to Lesley University to earn my PhD in curriculum and instruction, specifically in reading and writing strategies for students um, in grades 6 to 12. Um, so uh, that's really my, my educational sort of background and I guess just sort of casually I think I've always wanted to have a position as an assistant superintendent in curriculum and instruction. Um, that's really what, what has fueled my, um, my learning and my professional work for probably the last two decades. Um, and what attracted you to this position in Hopkinton? Well, I am currently working in the Uxbridge Public Schools as their Director of Curriculum Instruction and Assessment. And what has happened in the Uxbridge Public Schools is that there is a severe budget deficit and I was unsure of the stability of my position because um, if if, I, if there had been a more stable sense of what was going to happen with the budget there and, and I had a sense that my job was very secure, I would probably have just stayed where I was in Uxbridge. Um, so I did just recently apply to a couple of positions and I think I was selective about where I was applying. I did want it to be relatively close to home. I did want to go to a district where I knew that families were very much invested in education. And so I applied to the Hopkinton position and when I got to the interview, the first one, um, I had a very good sense that the people at that table, and there were probably 13 of them, uh, were very, very much interested um, in the skill set I could bring to the district, but they were also very, very much invested in teaching and learning and students and families and curriculum and achievement, and, and I thought that that was, that was lovely. When I got to the second interview, there was a bit more levity, and I thought these are people with whom I could sort of just fit right in, in terms of um, our personality and those pieces. So I'm really excited to be here. I 
hope for the rest of this process things will work out and, uh, and that I will be uh, ready to come on board next year. All right, well, best of luck to you. Thank you. It's a pleasure.